Less than a week from now, both UTEP and New Mexico State will have begun fall camp in preparation for their 2023 season openers on August 26th. Today, Conference USA getting in on the fun leading up to the new year, releasing its preseason media poll. Both New Mexico State and UTEP selected to finish in the middle of the road in Conference USA. The pundits picked the Aggies to finish in fifth place, while the Miners were found one spot behind them in sixth place. Western Kentucky, the pick to win the league with Liberty second, Middle Tennessee third, and Louisiana Tech fourth. Jackson. State, FIU, and Sam Houston rounded out the final three spots. The Aggies and Miners have different mindsets entering 2023. NMSU wants to build on last year's bowl win. UTEP wants to prove people wrong after a disappointing 2022. Expectations are higher. I think you, we recruited really well. Uh, going into a new conference, every one of them are good coaches, so I think there'll be a lot of close games and you're going to have to learn how to win the close games. Yeah, I feel like we feel comfortable, you know, as an underdog, but we feel like we got a, a really good team coming back, a really athletic team coming back, and we're looking forward to the season and, you know, we got a tough schedule. NMSU and UTEP both open the season in week zero, August 26th. The Miners on the road at Jacksonville State. The Aggies at home versus UMass as part of the release of the preseason poll. Conference USA also announcing five players to watch for each team. For New Mexico State quarterback Diego Pavia and wide receiver Jonathan Brady, they were named to the list, as was offensive lineman Shiaj Pete. On defense, the Aggies put two guys on the watch list. That would be defensive back Andre Selden and Arizona transfer Deion Wilson, who plays on the defensive line. As for UTEP, the Miners also with five players to watch per Conference USA. No surprise as quarterback Gavin Hardison made the cut, as did offensive lineman Elijah Klein. Defensively for UTEP, leading tackler Tyrese Knight was named to the list, as was defensive end Praise Omehule on special teams. The Australian punter Josh Hunt, uh, Sloan did make the cuts.